Hi there, my name is Vince from MyMateVince.com and in this video today I'm going to show you how you can reset your Xbox One. So this will apply for your Xbox One, One S or One X. So then if you go to sell it, the new owner will have to start from scratch. So all your data and everything will be wiped from it and he will be setting up the Xbox One the same as if he bought it new straight out of the box. So it's really easy to do. What we have to do is, if you have a look at the screen here, we've got to go to the top left hand side. So go up to your game attack and press A and then go across to where it says settings and press A and then what you want to do is you want to go down to where it says system and you want to go over to console info now I'm just going to uh, zoom in on the right hand side because there's a lot of information on here right okay so I'm just going to press A on console info and if you have a look it gives you three options there and one of them is reset console so I'm going to press A and now it says here reset your console and it gives you some options. So it says if you reset, your console will restart and erase all accounts, save games, setting, and home Xbox associations. You can choose whether to keep or erase your install games and apps. So let's say if we want to reset it completely, we're going to go there, reset and remove everything. Again, I'm just going to move over here just because there's information coming up on screen. So I'm going to press A. And now the screen will just go blank. Now don't panic, it's going to stay like this for quite a few minutes. And then the Xbox will start resetting itself. Now if you're going to move over to an Xbox One X or you plan to get another Xbox One in the future, it's not a problem because all your game saves and digital games will be saved up in the cloud anyway. So when you log in using your gamer tag, it will all be available to re-download again on your new Xbox. Right, so right now the Xbox is just resetting itself, so the uh, fan's gone off and now it's just booting itself back up. And it says preparing console, don't turn off or unplug your console. Right, so we just have to let this run right the way through. I'm going to fast forward through this bit. There we go, and as you can see now, this is the same screen you get when you first full turn on your Xbox when you buy it brand new, or when it's been completely reset, like in this case here. And now if we were to hit the home button here, you can see now that you would press A and then it will go through. Now annoyingly, if we were to hold down the home button, it doesn't let us shut down the console. Yet you can see that it's blanked out. So what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to press and hold the power button and then we will force the console to shut down. So let me show you that. Right, so I'm going to press and hold this down. I'm still holding it. Still holding it. And there we go, you can now see that that is now ready to be sold. Now just to show you what's going to happen when the new owner buys it, the new owner is going to set it up, you know, plug it into the TV, etc. And then he's going to, he or she, will turn it on using the power button. And let me show you the screen they're going to get up here. Okay, so you can see it's just preparing the console and then when it's done that it's going to come up with the screen that you've seen a minute ago where it's asking you to turn on your controller. And there we go, as you can see this is the screen we had a minute ago 
and this is what your new owner will see after it's prepared it there. So hopefully you found this video informative. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe for more how-to videos. Take care, bye now.